Hi guys, my name is Gunnar James Girl and welcome to a little tour and a look at the new architect homes in Sims Free Play. These are the architect homes that came out around the 28th of April 2016 and I've got to say I'm impressed with these houses. I like these a lot. I've taken a little look at a few of them and the ones that I have looked at really like them. There are nine simoleon houses and three LP ones and three SP ones. In this video we're going to take a little look at the simoleon houses so let's go ahead. This is the first house, which is a standard sized lot. Look at this stuff in here. They've got these orange sofas, the orange dining table, which is all SP stuff. There's got these, um, got this high table and chairs, which was just released recently for a few days. It was in a, the featured sale for maybe a week or so, but we could, can't get it any longer. We've got some of the orange bedroom furniture. There's a lot of SP stuff in this house and yet you can buy it for simoleons. And there's also this retro TV, which again were on sale quite recently. And quite a lot of the houses that I've looked at have got this TV. And I think it's an awesome TV. I did actually buy two when they were in the sale for SP. And I'm so annoyed that I bought them now because I could have just built the houses with simoleons. But never mind. It's also got this fondue set, which... I have a feeling that the fondue set is an awful lot of um, SP. Let me go and check. Right, I've been out to check. The fondue set is 150 SP. Oh my goodness, that I just can't even believe that. So I'm definitely going to be building this house to get the fondue set. I can't believe that. This is a nice little house. This is house number two, standard size lot and two floors, is it? Yeah, this is two floors. Oh, it's got all the Teen Idol instruments in here, in here so that's quite handy. It's got some of these stools. What else has it got? I don't think it's got anything else massively limited or... Um, no. It's a nice house though. It's got how many bedrooms? One, two, three bedrooms. House number three is a standard sized house again. It's a bungalow. Yes, it's a bungalow. And this has got... This, I've got all these flowers. Wow. Loads of flowers. It has got the make-out sofa there, which I love the make-out sofa. Um, it's got the fondue set again, oh my goodness, it's got the fondue set, it's got that retro TV, it's got some of these orangey gold sofas, it's got a fish tank, it's got these table and chairs, wow, there's some good stuff in this house also, yep, that could be, potentially build that one, oh it's got that parrot, oh no, still haven't got my parrot in a cage. Is it a parrot in a cage or is it that parrot that I wanted? Like, no, it's not a parrot, is it, that I want? It's the owl. What am I talking about? See, I'm getting confused all the time. It's the owl that I want, not the parrot. Somebody build a house with an owl in so I can get it. Record player, is that maybe SP as well? LP, I think it's probably SP. That is a good house. I'm definitely, definitely going to build that one. House number four is a standard size house. Two floors. Yes, two floors. Doesn't look like this has got anything particularly special in it, although I do like the style and the design of the house. It's got a little pool in the back garden. Upstairs. This is nice. There's no particularly limited items in this house, it doesn't seem like. It's got one of those rugs, which is an LP item, I believe. That desk is nice. What's that desk? That's a nice house. Nothing. I probably will not be building that one. It's not got anything particularly in it that I want. Or it has got one of those stools. But it's a nice house, whoever designed that, nonetheless. House number five. This has a basement. Oh, three floors. A basement with three floors. First floor. It's got one of those SP suns. It's got the urban furniture kitchen. Love the kitchen. Oh, it's got a lift. This is a nice house. It's got some of those rugs. I'm not sure whether they're LP or SP rugs, but it has some. It's got the slide. Let's have a look what's in the basement. Oh, it's got drum, drum kit. Those table and chairs. A few of the, few of the um, instruments. Ping pong table. Is that something that I want? I think that I can't get a ping pong table. I might have to look into that. I think that was a limited thing that we can't get at the moment. And then if we go if we go from the basement, we'll go up to the second floor. Ooh. Oh, look at that little area. Sandpit and that outside. 
nice little playroom there for the kids. Oh, it's got the Christmas um, Christmas house. I love that house. It's so adorable. Oh, it's got an exercise bike. I'm pretty sure it was the exercise bike a prize from the Seniors Quest? If memory serves me, I might be completely wrong there, but I think, I think it was. Oh, it's got a fish tank. It's got an arcade machine, which you win if you have unlocked the ice capade. No, not ice capade. What's it called? The ice arcade. The thing on Mysterious Island, the arcade. That would be handy for some people who haven't unlocked that. And on the next floor, not much going on, on the top floor in all honesty, but yeah, nice house. A few little bits and pieces in there. Oh, I missed that. How did I miss that? It's got a fondue set in. This amazing fondue set. Yep, it's got one of them. House number six. This is a premium lot house. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at this basement. Orange everywhere. Wow, this is, I can't believe this is a Somalian house. This is crazy. It's got a fondue set. Madness. It's got one of those TVs. The SP that has gone into this house is incredible. First floor, it's got the bar. That's SP. Everything is, basically everything in this is SP. Party streamers, you may not have those doors. This is like, they're like different, oh look, this is cool. There's different colours. So like the bottom floor is the orange floor. This is like the purple floor. The unicorn. That was a limited prize, wasn't it? One of the very early quests. That painting, I can't remember, the rainbow unicorn thing. I think so. Oh, it's got one of these retro TVs. The life guard thing. Was that a limited time? Um, not a limited time, like a prize from doing a quest, I think it was. It's like showers at the back. I like this. It's awesome. Oh, it's got one of the Sonic Air uh, mirrors. So upstairs, this is the blue room. Again, there's so much SP furniture. Madness. And then up to the next floor. This is the green floor. All of this SP furniture. Got one of these TVs. One of the, another one of the retro TVs. Wow. This is a good house to build. I think it's got an arcade uh, machine. This is a computer that I haven't seen much of, so I'm assuming it may be um, an SP computer. Basically, everything in this house is SP. What's this? I've never seen this bar before. What is this bar from, guys? Oh my goodness. Is it the Latin bar? I want that in my life. I'm going to build this. It's got one of these TVs as well. Wow. Oh my goodness, yeah, building this house, definitely. 100% building this house. The next house, this is a standard size lot, I think. How many floors have we got? Two floors. This looks like a nice house. Doesn't look to be anything massively um, limited or anything inside it, but it's a nicely designed house with some nice, nice bits in. It's got a lift in it. Oh my goodness, look at these. Uh, these are LPs, aren't they, or something, maybe? can't remember but they've got these <laughs> these armory things this is a nice room look at this little room for this for one of the kids or something I like that I like that dresser as well wow this is a nice house good build whoever did this I want those wow that's a nice little area nice yeah this is a nice house I like this a lot it's not got anything massively like I said it's not got anything massively rare or anything in it but it's a nice build good job house number eight is a bungalow it's premium lot on a bungalow a premium lot on a bungalow a bungalow on a premium lot is what I'm meant to say it's got some of these Easter topiaries if you've missed out on those it's got the table and chairs here another one over here as well Got some of the red ones. This is quite a nice house. Look at that um, icy uh, table. <laughs> so it doesn't go. Actually, it looks alright. It just like, like maybe like a tablecloth or something. Uh, nothing massive in here apart from kind of a few Easter topiaries and the table and chairs. Out in the back. This is a nice outdoor area. I like this. And this is the last Simoleon house. What is this? A one floor. Yeah, one floor standard size lot. This looks like a nice build. It's got like that little area in the middle, which I love, like a little donut shape this house is. 
it's got some of these chairs, the red ones, which is a nice little kitchen. Uh, what else has it got? Oh, this is a nice build. Oh, look, like a little cinema area here. Oh, look at the little baby room at the back. Cute. Yeah, so nothing massively rare in this house, but a nice build. It's got um, a Santa snow globe thing that we could get at Christmas, but we can't get any more. It's a nice build. Look at the front. Isn't that cute? Cute looking house. So there you go guys, that is a little look at all of the nine Simoleon architect homes. What do you guys think? Are you as impressed as I am? Because I am definitely impressed. I've been quite disappointed by them in the past. These ones are epic and I'm going to get building some of them. I will also do a little tour of the SP and the LP houses. I will link that down below and on the screen once I have done it. Thank you so much for watching this video. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you are new. And I will see you guys soon for a new video. Thanks for watching. Bye.